can act as a pry point, and you can do that, and all of a sudden it all just comes apart, and it's wonderful and magical. I had a bit of a glob of Vaseline that prevented this half sphere to fill all the way, but there's enough of it there that it's still a key. It's a perfect little key. Gonna fit right in there. It's just it, it didn't completely get it all, um, but it's gonna work just fine for its purpose. The other thing that I can see happened is we didn't get enough Vaseline here, and it broke a little bit of the stone out on this on this edge here. Tiny little bit. We still have the keys in place. Uh, that won't harm or affect anything. So we did really well. So this is one piece of the mold. This is uh, when we put this together, that's, that'll go there. And then now we still have to get the bottom out from here, which might, be, might prove to be a little difficult. But uh, let's see what we can do. So again, we've got flashing here and here. That could act as pry point. Let me use the chisel because it's a little flatter. It's coming right out. Ta da! Three piece stone mold. Now, I gotta tell you, molds have evolved. These are very basic, basic, basic molds. Uh, these are very old school, uh, with the exception of using the epoxy cow, which is kind of a new, newer material. Um, but this is basically how molds have been made for a long, long time. Anyway, this will make a lovely piece. We'll clean this out. We can put Miss Cherie on that for...